We are the keepers of the flame, the sacred order. Let the ceremony begin. And today, Faithful Acolytes, we take a look at this. And with this is from Chomps, it is the Cranberry Habanero Beef Sticks. And uh, there's a lot of verbiage here. I don't really care about any of that though. So beef sticks, it's hard to find some nice, good, hot, spicy ones. Lots of jerkies out there, but jerky is not my thing. So we've got beef, cranberries, water, uh, there is habanero pepper in here, black pepper as well, red pepper, oh, there's a lot of spices in this. This is going to be interesting. <laughs> very, very interesting. All right, so I guess it's going to be easier to open. Well, let's open the top. Let's do that. Let's take a look at these things, all in their glory. And we've got 10 of them to a box here. Am I gonna eat all 10 of them? I don't know, I might, you never know. Put this off to the side though for now. And so we have the customary thing here. Take a look at these. See the cranberry right there at the end. Looks pretty normal. Uh, let's take a little look see in here. Just pretty much standard stuff. Well, let's get cracking. Looks pretty nice. These are flavored really, really well. Cranberry is very low key in there. Getting some beef, black pepper. I am getting cranberry, it's just not forceful. There is some low, uh, kind of a low heat. What's interesting is that it's kind of a sharp heat, but it's very minimal. Is there a touch on the greasy side? Not too bad. I quite like these. Oh, I think I'd rather... This one's split in half with the cranberry. <laughs> I think I would rather have these without cranberry, if I'm being honest. The little bit of fruitiness is nice. Cranberry is not one I think those the other super well with beef though. Better to save that, I think, for turkey and use blueberries, blackberries, that sort of thing. For the beef. He's really low key though. I'm gonna go for I'm gonna try to go for a burn here. I'm probably gonna have a four or five of these. I would give these a default one, but not much more. 
they are a bit on the chewy side as well. A lot of beef sticks, you know, you get them and the insides will be mush. These are fairly firm, they have some substance to them. Alright, here's number four. I oh, like, sorry, it's number three. What? Well, I'm not going to be able to do all ten of these just because. What I run into, you know, I'll get tired of the flavor. I get. I'll never. <laughs> Never get anywhere with that competitive eating career because I get tired of flavors way too fast. Oh, you almost never see them doing stuff like this either. I think Matt Stoney maybe did a popcorn one. That just looked brutal. You do potato chips also, same thing. That's a hard pass. <laughs> Not even to mention, you know, the next day, right? You're eating pounds and pounds of food. Well, a, your body can't process it that fast. So a lot of it won't even attempt, it'll just get passed through it. But you think about that, say, you eat 16 pounds of poutine or something like that, you're gonna get some pretty considerable evacuation the next day. Most of them don't really get into that part of it. Other than, I think Furious Pete did mention it at one time. Also, I think maybe Nick Cotto Avocado did as well. It's almost like they dotted the uh, it's not really integrated. You kinda of get a bunch of beef, then a cranberry, then a bunch of beef again. That one in particular was About every inch and a half segment. It was a cranberry. So they're giving this three flames. <laughs> I'm now on my fifth one. Maybe we'll do six. We'll take a really hard run out. It's all grass fed, grass finished, whatever that means. We're going to do two of these for every flame rating that they give it. So they did three flames, we're going to do six of them to see. Actually, I'm going to show you this. See, that's kind of what I mean. And see, that dark area is a cranberry. Uh-oh. Timber. All right, there's five. It's not really building above a default one. Very 
fairly low amount of heat. I don't think these are going to be a challenge for anybody. Now we get into the question of will it be satisfying for Chili Head? Not from a heat perspective. Flavor and texture wise, these are fine. I mean, they're, it's an okay ish flavor. I, I probably won't ever get these again. I'm gonna go. I mean, it's a. It's a huh. I can't call this the one. I thought. Maybe I was getting enough build. Maybe I was getting enough mouthy to call this a one, but no. Well, I mean a legit one rather. We'll leave it a default one. All right, there's six of them. Probably pretty close to getting my sodium in for the day. <laughs> I'm not gonna kid any beyond this stuff. It's just fine. I guess point across. Yeah, I'm tired of eating them. So that was six. Six of these chomps. I mean, they're fine. They're just not. I would have hoped for a little bit more forcefulness from the habaneros and it just really wasn't there. Flavor, flavor wise, they're, they're fine. Not my preference. When it comes to meat sticks, I prefer, I guess, a more meaty nature to it rather than meat and fruit. But for what they were going for, I think they did it really well. It's kind of a flavor where if your tastes go in that direction, you'll probably like this more. But I have no complaints here. Heat wise is, like I said, a little on the disappointing side. But I mean, it, it is, they're de you can definitely tell there's something in there. It just, to me, these are not particularly challenging. They're, they're not, probably not for anybody. Actually, I mean, they're probably are probably hotter than a lot of things, you know, like you pick up Slim Jims or whatever. It's probably going to be hotter than something like that, but it, it still is relatively low. Even with the build, I mean, I, I just went through six of them. <laughs> so, but yeah, I mean, it's worth a go. If you're, if you like meat sticks and you like to have some different flavor combinations, definitely worth checking out. From that perspective, but definitely not for heat either. So, anyway, there you go. The Chomps Cranberry Habanero Meat Sticks. Now go forth in peace to serve the flame.